Coco Frisk leads it off. And takes a strike. Moss would appear to be the guy most affected in the Oakland lineup by the trade of Ioana Cespedes. His power numbers drop tremendously after the trade. And this ball's well hit to right, and you can forget about it. He adds to the power numbers there into the seats over the bullpen, and it's 2 nothing. Two down, Kansas City on the board. He flight out to right his first time. And he lines a single down the line. Could be bases. Filled up and throwing in, and it is a stand-up double for Lorenzo Kane, and the game is tied. Game gets going on. In the air, shallow left, third on. That's going to break the tie. Kane scores. 3 2, Kansas City. But right now, it's all on the shoulders of. 23-year-old Ventura in the air to center field and pretty well hit. Lorenzo Kane is back and has no chance. Brandon Moss has done it again. Straight away center field, three-run shot, and the A's have the lead. it up the middle and through and another run for the Oakland A's driven in by Derek as the A's have batted around here in the sixth and there's a shot to center and that's going to score another run here comes Norris he'll score easily standing up and it is seven to three man and that's where John Lester is when he's got it going grounded up the middle and under the glove of Lowry and into center field. Infielders crossed there and neither could glove it. And there's a loser. It's Gregerson as the runner goes. And the throw is high. And then Escobar had to make sure he held the bag. Made 32 starts between Boston and Oakland. And there's a base hit up the middle and a score run. And it's 7-4. They're at first and second with one out and one in. And Billy Butler coming to the plate. Can bail him out of this jam. Into right center field. That's going to be down for a hit. And it's going to score a run. Lorenzo Kane crosses. And it's a 7-5 game. the adjustment to protect against the breaking ball. Struck him out. Infante goes down swinging. Back-to-back -back strikeouts for Gregerson. The Royals score three, but leave the tying run 90 feet away.
in the air, right field. Aoki is there. Hit the ball out of the ballpark. To right, a long, long run from Hope to Reddick. Won't get there. It falls for a hit. And the tie run is on in the bottom half of the ninth. Bags this year. The bump by Escobar right back to the mound. Doolittle will go to first. And the tying run moves up 90 feet. Any kind of dribbler is a base hit. There goes Dyson. Throw to third. He is safe. The tying run has moved up another 90 feet. Rev it up. Winfield in. the catch but that's going to tie the game it is seven to seven in the wild card and two out rbis And that is going to send us to the 11th inning. Hey. Strike three called to end the 11th. The leadoff walk in the 12th. Gets it down. Nix throws him out. Go ahead, run at second. Ball gets away, and the runner moves up to third. That is huge. The more evenly spaced you are. Slapped into left field, and the A's have the lead. Alberto Cayaspo delivers in the 12th, and it's 8-7. to seven. What a nice piece of hitting. center field. Gomes is back and so is third and the ball is off the wall. Hosmer around second. He's on his way to third standing and the tying run is 90 feet away. What an at bat. Fouls off tough, tough pitch after tough pitch. He drives the ball to left center field. Whenever I see a ball go up, get Cologne and you got Gordon on deck. High chopper. They'll never get him. Tie game. A chance. Go on this pitch. There he goes. They pitched out. And off the glove of Derek Norris. They knew it was coming. Now looking for a two-out hit. 